Hey folks, this is Vociferous with Halo Waypoint. Today we're going to look at something you've all seen before, phantoms. Yeah, that's right, the Covenant's primary method for troop deployment behind enemy lines. Pretty, isn't she? Well, we're not here to sightsee, we're here for the explosions. And when it comes to phantoms, the explosions are definitely something to behold. The glorious sights and sounds of Covenant metal heated to the point of, well, you know the story. These birds come down with a few well-placed shots to the turbines which flank their fuselage. But for most of you, this is common knowledge. What isn't really common knowledge is just how many of these things can be taken down throughout Halo's campaigns. And some of the interesting places you'll find them. We all know about the low-hanging fruit out there. Some of them are just begging to be plucked from the sky. Like this one right here. It gives you the deer in the headlights look for a good while. Yes, I have a scorpion tank, and yes, it's aimed at your face. Tank beats everything! Oh, man! I could do this all day! Now, there are always those situations where you'll get to a phantom with inadequate weapons, and all the spraying and praying isn't going to do a thing. But maybe you passed a few you thought were indestructible, but weren't. Or maybe you didn't even see them to begin with. That's where the art of the takedown comes in. Any respectable Halo players should at least give one solid campaign run to hunting down and killing the last of the Phantoms. So here are a few pointers for those who are not in the know. First things first, bring a big gun. Heavy ordnance is pretty much half the battle when you're gunning for these guys. Second, aim well. The Phantom has some key locations which, when struck repeatedly, will create a uh, wildcat destabilization. Well, 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 sort of. Is that burnt fur I smell? And last but not least, it's all about keeping your eyes open. Some of these things show up in the darndest of places. Like this one. It comes in low to drop off drones, and if you hit it enough, it'll drop right on top of them. Ouch, you guys didn't see that one coming, did you? If you keep on taking these out, you might end up forcing the Covenant into a truce. After all, good chieftains are hard to come by these days. This one comes in to drop off a wraith, but it looks like that's not the only thing that's dropping today. Free spare parts for everyone. And the great thing about the takedown is that it's not just about pretty lights, there's actually a strategy to it. For example, the more phantoms you clear from this Congo line, the less ghosts you'll be forced to deal with later on down the road. Okay, I lied. It is, in fact, all about the pretty lights. Oh, so pretty. I'm Vociferous with Halo Waypoint. Later, guys. They got anti-air raids from the next lake bed, Chief.